Good morning, everybody. I am Dr. Surya Prakash, a senior consultant urologist working at Virinchi Hospitals, Banjara Hills Road Number One. Uh, basically, as a urologist, I deal with disorders of uh, urinary tract and the genital tract of both males and females. Today, I will be talking to you about a very common problem faced by all the age groups and both the sexes, that is the kidney stone disease. In the last decade, there have been a tremendous improvements in the management or the treatment of the kidney stone disease. There be, the treatment has, the technology has revolutionized the treatment of kidney stone disease. So I will be, be sharing with you what the latest advances have happened in the treatment of kidney stone disease. And one of the most important of these advancements is the laser surgery. Earlier days, the, we were subjecting the patients to open surgery, that means we used to give a big incision or be cut to remove the kidney stone. Gone are those days. Now the patient comes to the hospital walking in, undergoes the laser treatment and just goes out of the hospital the next day without any incision or without even a, seeing a drop of blood coming out of his body. This procedure is called RIRS and the RIRS stands for retrograde intrarenal surgery. In this procedure, whoever has got a stone in his kidney has to visit a urologist. We will do certain basic investigations in the form of an ultrasound, and blood test like serum creatinine to, show the, to know the functional status of the kidneys. Once we know, come to know or we confirm that, that, that so and so particular patient has got renal stone disease or kidney stone disease, then we advise the patient to go for this RIRS procedure. There are certain indications. We cannot treat all the stones with this procedure. Stones which are very big like more than 2 or 2.5 centimeters it takes a little longer time to do this surgery, so we subject them to another procedure called PCNL. By and large, any stone of about less than 2 centimeters can easily be treated with this laser surgery. In this procedure, this procedure is done under general anesthesia in operation theater. A very thin flexible scope, it is called flexible urethrorenal scope. It is passed through the urinary passage, into, through the urinary bladder, up into the ureter, into the kidney. So, with the flexible urethral endoscope, the urologist can access stone anywhere in the kidney. Let it be in the upper part of the kidney, lower part or any difficult location. We can go reach and see the stone and with the help of a laser, the energy used to break the stone is laser energy. The laser what we use in Virinci is a holmium high voltage holmium laser. So, once the stone is visualized with the flexible scope, then the next step I do is I pass a laser fiber through the scope up into the kidney to reach the stone. Then the next step is firing of the stone. That means the dusting of the stone. The stone will be powdered into dust with the laser. All the procedure takes about in half an hour and within half an hour that stone completely gets powdered or dissolved and we put a stent. The patient comes out of anesthesia and he's maybe after few hours he will be normal like way he was before surgery and we usually give them an antibiotic course for maybe of 3 to 4 days which he can take at home. There will be a urinary catheter which will be removed the next day and a DJ stent will be placed during the procedure which will be removed maybe 2 weeks later as an outpatient procedure. We usually discharge the patients the next day that means after surgery after 24 hours patient will be discharged home and he will be able to do all his activities in a couple of days. So that is the beauty or that is the advantage of the laser surgery and this is available at Virinci hospitals. We are regularly performing this procedure. I can show you some pictures of this. Uh, this is a pictorial representation of the RIRS surgery. We can see here the kidney here and there is a brown colored stone in the kidney. The instrument what we use is flexible urethrorhinoscope. This is a scope being passed through the urinary bladder up into the kidney. And you can see the laser being fired. So the stone is, stone is made into small fragments and some of the fragments are being retrieved with the basket. So now the stone is completely cleared. So this entire these four pictures give an idea about how an RIRS surgery is performed completely incisionless and bloodless. So we at Virinci Hospital have got a, the com comprehensive treatment for kidney stone disease. Uh, all the age groups can be treated who have patients who have got kidney stone disease can be treated in this hospital. Uh, we have got the latest equipment all the procedures like newer advancements like ESWL, URSL, 
PCNL, these are the endoscopic procedures or, which are done for kidney stone disease and the most recent and the latest technology is RIRS and we are, I am happy to share with you all that we have all the technology and expertise to do this RIRS surgery which is the most latest treatment in the uh, treatment of kidney stone disease and I, 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 I wish all the patients to get the benefit of this latest technology in the treatment of kidney stone disease. Thank you.